Hey, what's up everybody? How are you doing? It's David again, photographer from Barcelona. And today I am back to POV street photography in Barcelona. And although I went back to the same place that I did another video before, in the Gothic Quarter in Barcelona, this time I decided to go back because for two months in a year, something really special happens and is the light. This time of the year is perfect for this location because the sun hits the bridge and creates a magical light and this amazing kind of atmosphere, the mood and the location is beautiful already. So imagine with this kind of light. And another key point is that the sun doesn't get to the bridge too late. So the light is still soft and nice and warm. Now, right now is the perfect time of the year to do this. So that's why I went back to the same location. But on the way there earlier in the morning, I found other cool streets to photograph and everything. So I don't know, just take a look and let me know what you think. I'll leave you to it. First I came to this place because there is a church in the background and I, and I thought it could be interesting but I wasn't really happy with the result and so I just moved on. I came to uh, this amazing building which is the headquarters of the post service and I was just waiting for somebody to walk by. I knew I had to be at the bridge by 9 o'clock, so in the meantime I was just walking around and checking streets. And then I found this place and I was running to catch a woman walking. And I really loved this street, so I stayed here for a few minutes just taking pictures. I like the layers of this street. Like you have a lot of foreground, things in the background, it's really nice. Then I went looking for a street that I saw another day that I was walking around Barcelona. And I saw this street, which is very interesting. It has like this old ceiling and I was just waiting for a long time actually for somebody to be in the frame. Next to that one there is another very similar street also with wooden ceilings and it's really nice but I had the same problem that I had to wait for a long time to see somebody walking and I just had to be patient and at the end I got this girl walking the dog. As I was leaving I saw the same girl walking back and then I took the phone out and I just wanted to try with the phone to see what I get. And actually I'm not unhappy with it. I went back to a couple of locations that I was before and I just tried with the phone just for fun, just to test it. And again, I think it's quite okay, it's fine. It did a good job, just the pictures have a very digital look and also over sharpening, I think. But overall, I think it's fine. 
After that, I saw that the sun was starting to come out. So I just went to find it and see if I could get something with nice light. Here I was just yes, walking around randomly, just trying to find a street or something interesting to photograph. I didn't get very lucky. But I found this street, very small street, with the sun in the back. So I just tried to get something here. And it was time for me to get to the bridge. I just went around the cathedral, just checking around. But I was already thinking about the bridge. And that's what I did. And there it was, the Alpón del Bisba, or the Bishop's Bridge. Is how they call it. It's not that old or anything, it doesn't have a really cool story. It connects to the main government building and it's used by the presidents as an overpass. Then I was just double checking with the phone with the app Sun Locator that tells you where the sun is gonna be and where it is, just to make sure that the sun was gonna be right behind the bridge and I could choose a nice position to wait for it. I like to get very low just so I can get something in the foreground and get it out of focus. That gives more depth to the picture. Then it was just a waiting game, basically. Just waiting for the right person, somebody that you liked, with nice clothes or something that draws your attention. And that's it. This one here caught me with the phone in my hand and I just had to use the phone, I didn't have time to set the camera, so I just took it with the phone and it's quite nice. And once the sun hits the bridge, it's just magical, the light is amazing, you can do no wrong here, it's just, every picture looks fantastic. Alright, so those were the pictures. As you can see, the location was 
perfect for me it was just fun and it was just amazing to see and to experience and to get to photograph it and i'm quite happy with some of the pictures so i don't know i'm just happy that this happened and that i went there again and again if you plan to go there and if you're in spain right now or in barcelona right now you have just until february probably so december january probably february is the right time to go and do this from my side that's all let me know in the comments if you have any question or anything to say and i'll see you guys in the next one bye